Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Chantel. This is my basic journey. I live and travel in my minivan with my dog, Joey. And the last couple weeks has been very crazy. If you guys have been following along, I went to Sedona, went up to the Grand Canyon, went to Vegas, hit up Zion. It's just been a very like tourist packed couple of weeks. And so I kind of want to just catch you guys up because I haven't actually sat down and vlogged and I don't know it's been like five days now <laughs> and so I'm gonna catch you up because after Zion I went back to Vegas and I spent some time with my family and like I said I did not vlog a lot of it I did record some of it so I'll show you guys a little bit of what I did so let's backtrack a little bit because after we got back from Zion National Park we went back to Vegas when we got back to Vegas, one of the first things that we did was go to Fremont Street. So I went there with my grandmother and my mom and we just had a good time. So I'm going to show you guys some of that footage now. Hey guys, so we're heading to Fremont Street. I'm pretty excited. We're going to go check it out. Bring you guys with me.
as you guys saw, Fremont Street was an absolute blast and I had such a good time going with my grandma and going with my mom. It's just one of those memories that I'm going to have forever and it was just a lot of fun. So while we were in Las Vegas, we wanted to escape the city a little bit, so we went up to Mount Charleston. Unfortunately, I was very, very tired this day. I did not get a lot of sleep, so I ended up falling asleep in the car, so I did not get a lot of footage from Mount Charleston, but you guys can see a little bit of it here. So Vegas is kind of known for being like the adult playground and there are tons of things to do, especially if you like to gamble or if you like to drink or if you like to see strippers, tons of that going around. But if you don't enjoy those things, there are still tons to do while you're in Vegas. And something that I wanted to do while I was there was go to Area 15. That's where Meow Wolf is and they have a whole bunch of different things that you can go and see there. But I really wanted to go to the immersive Van Gogh experience that they had there and so I kind of dragged my my mom along and we brought her cousins with and it was absolutely amazing um, the entire place it was at area 15 in Vegas and so I'll show you guys some of that now you've arrived
not gonna lie you guys area 15 was probably like my favorite thing we did in Vegas and it can get very expensive the one thing that we went to go do which was the Van Gogh experience thing was $40 so each different like section in the building was another fee so I know the meow wolf was like another 50 bucks and then you know they had like the weird places you could go to which ranged from like 20 to $50 a piece so you can see that if if you were going to go into this building and do all 15 different things that they had to offer it could get very expensive they also had a couple bars and a restaurant it was just a very very cool place to go another thing that i did while i was in vegas is something small but something that you guys will appreciate we got joey a haircut and it is way past his haircut time usually i go every three months he was getting pretty shaggy so we went to a place called groomingdale's which i thought was super adorable but they were able to get him in that same week which was was very hard for me to do while I was in Arizona. I tried like multiple different places and all of them were pushed back like three weeks to a month and so it was very very hard to get him in somewhere but he finally got a haircut and he looks like a very handsome boy. As you guys could see I was pretty busy from the time that I got back from Zion until this moment now and I was really taking the time to spend my time with my family and just enjoy their company. I didn't want to be vlogging the entire time so I did try to record some of the things that we were doing but I did not vlog a lot of it, but I had such a good time visiting and just going and seeing the sights in Vegas was awesome. I do want to go back sometime and really take the time to explore the strip and see the different hotels because we only did the strip for one night and it was only a couple of hours, but there is so much to do there and especially because I wanted to spend as much time with family as possible. We really just, you know, limited the amount of time that we spent on the strip, but next time I go there, we're gonna, we're gonna have a stripping good time. Now, as you guys can see, I am back in my van and it's been a few days actually since I've left Vegas and I'm now in California. Um, it was really hard for me to pick up my camera and record and I actually went to this really beautiful campground in Tehachapi, California, up on Tehachapi Mountain and it was very beautiful but I couldn't even bring myself to record anything. I did not record it at all and I don't know if it's just because I was kind of in this like little bit of depression after leaving my mom because I don't get to see her. It's making me choke up just thinking about it, but I just really needed some time to, you know, get back to my center here and, you know, reminisce about the time that I had with my mom. And it was really awesome seeing her and seeing my grandma and meeting family that I've never met before. It's just been a really, really good time in Vegas. I had such a great time. But I am in California now and I have a whole bunch of new adventures planned. I'm so excited to share them with you guys. I hope you had fun coming along to Vegas with me and seeing what I did when I was there. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed yet, please do so below. I'll also put a link in my description box for my patreon in case you guys want to check that out and help support my channel otherwise i'll see you guys in the next video